Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Huh? <laughs> we got the, Paul in so sort of clear. You can tell something's wrong because I'm paler than you. And I, I feel like I. But for once, you're not blurry. Yeah. All right. Well, well so Paul got a new camera. Fancy dancy. Hair on my face now. You can actually see. This is going to drive a lot of people to do the audio only version of this. <laughs> it's only taken how many, how many years? Ago? It's five. <laughs> you don't yeah. understand. I, I bought over Christmas a $300 or maybe it was a $200. I think it was called Logitech Brio. Yeah. Didn't change a thing. In fact, I think I used it once on the show. Um, but it didn't, you know, and I've used three different versions of that C920. I actually, um, uh, this came up because Mary Jo got her camera replaced by Twit and uh, made a similar difference, I guess. And um, they said, "Oh, we should do this for Paul." And I was like, "Guys, I don't want. I don't. You know, it's not going to make a difference or whatever." And but the guy John at Twit uh, looked it up and they sent me <laughs> C920 in sometime in 2013. That's mm -hmm. how long I've had that camera. Um, although I own like three of them, like I've actually yeah. purchased some of them because you know, again, I sort of been trying to fix this for a long time i don't know well it's funny because i'm using a c920 yeah and, and right nobody would know that know that it's i don't know so actually so let's just do this live why not mm -hmm. <laughs> let me let me switch the other camera's still connected can, is that something i can do on the fly well, maybe not out. yeah i don't see a way to do it uh it doesn't offer it oh no yeah it does let's see switch to that now see to me, those colors are much more natural looking. So those colors look much more natural, but you're... I'm definitely blurry. Yeah. It yeah, it's funny It's funny how it doesn't look that way to me, although... Like, and then it just dropped blurry even worse. Yep, yep. I start, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah let's get rid of that. Well, I'll probably... I need to... I have not adjusted this at all. So this is just... It's To me, this is real whited out and Welcome not to my great, world. but... Um, I recommend SPF 50. Then now the SPF 50 with <laughs> no, moisturizer I, would be. I, I really do have skin color, right? <laughs> well, anyways, we'll it looks like your internet's sort of fixed, maybe. Well, I don't, you know, cross your fingers and kill a chicken or whatever you do. Um, <laughs> knock a, I don't know what I say. I don't, uh, knock on wood. I don't know. Uh, yeah, so we had all those problems yesterday during the show, but then afterwards it was fine. And it was had been fine all day Monday and Tuesday after being really bad over the weekend. And I, I obviously I can't explain it. I'm what I'm kind of hoping is that RCN, you know, mm -hmm. is a semi reputable company, uh, you know, would no. I mean, I know that if I called and they looked at my account, they'd be like, Oh yeah, God, you, you've had huge problems. You know, I, I'm sure they'd be able to tell that. And I'm hoping there's like an automated thing that corrects it or whatever. So anyway, we'll see. But yeah, I, all day after the show, we did the show. It was terrible, and then all day long after that was fine. And I was I sat here all I was on this thing all day long, and I did you know two and a half hours on Windows Weekly. Fantastic. Actually, Brad, you know what the best test is, what? and uh, and I and I did this on purpose yesterday. Um, I had about forty minutes to kill before we started the show, yeah, uh, the Windows Weekly show, and I I played Call of Duty, right, mm -hmm. and. The reason is not just because it's a diverting, you know, thing to do, but um, that thing would sh like if you had a connection problem in that game, it 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 makes itself known immediately. Like there's no, it, it just you know what I mean. There's no way mm -hmm. to to fake it in a live online, you know, uh, online multiplayer game. Rock solid, you know. So which is the way it had been for four years until last weekend. So yeah. So there's a fun bug, by the way, with Flight Sim on the Xbox. Fun bug. Is it a loading time bug? <laughs> no, I didn't have any real loading time issues. But there, so if you play Flight Sim mm -hmm. and you've ever played it on your PC and you turn it on and you install it on your Xbox, it yeah. defaults because it cloud game oh, saves. So mouse and keyboard, right? Yes. And well, so I, I pointed it out because the first thing you see is a little mouse pointer up in the corner, and it's like what? But if you move the stick on the controller, it turns into the big circular thing, you know. But it doesn't. Not if you oh. if you have if you've played it on PC. It sticks to keyboard and mouse. So what you have to do, oh. and this is what I did, is you have to go get a mouse, plug it mm -hmm. into your Xbox, you move the mouse over and change it to the default controller. Then it's fixed. But it took me up. Oh. Yeah. It's a fun little Okay, button. so I've noticed the mouse pointer. I, I, I didn't play it on a PC, apparently. <laughs> so I didn't have that issue. But um, 
<laughs> That's funny. I did see, and I have not looked up, but apparently they've issued a, an update already, and I'm sure mm-hmm. there'll be three more in the next few days, but... And one of the things that's supposed to improve is the load time thing. And mm-hmm. and that's the one thing to me that's a little disappointing. Like I, you know, you crash the plane, I'm trying to do stupid stuff. I'm trying, like flying around Paris, trying to fly under the Eiffel Tower like an idiot, crash into the ground. And then you're like, all right, I'll try that again. And it's like, you sit there and you, it's just like, <laughs> it's like slowly moving across. It's like, mm-hmm. guys, we're just in the game. Like, um, so apparently that uh, will be improved. Yep. We've got that. PlayStation sold 10 million. Microsoft you, sold Xbox has something. had its best quarter ever for sales. I guess probably by revenue and who knows, maybe that's tied to the high price of the console. I don't know, but I mean how many I mean if you had a guess, right? Do you think they did half that less? So there was an estimate out by an analyst firm called Nico Partners and they pegged it around six and a half million. Oh, that's great. Yeah. See, that, but, would, that would be good. Yeah, because we all know last generation was roughly two to one. That gap narrows. That's a good thing for Xbox. So, yeah, and I, I <clears throat> look. I thought they were competitive last time, but I, I, they are absolutely competitive this time. Mm-hmm. And um, if anything, I mean, the S lately has gotten a lot of positive press because it's inexpensive. Yep. You know, relatively, and it's solid. Like this is, you know, these are great consoles, and the the fact that they have an inexpensive offering is something PlayStation doesn't quite match, right? Pretty much. Pretty much. No builds of uh, Windows 11 yet. Yeah, but I think the last one came out last Thursday, so I bet today's the day. Hopefully we... I'm, I'm just hoping it solves the ShareX bug, or we find out whether or not it's a bug with ShareX or with Windows 11. I suspect right. it's Windows 11, because it worked in previous builds and works in Windows 10. Well, I mean, it, it, because of the nature of ShareX, it's likely they're doing some kind of a... Um, you know, semi dubious, yeah. you know, non documented API thing or something, you know. Um, so, yeah, I'm sure it, it will be interesting to see what fixes it. I guess if, if uh, they issue a Windows 11 update that fixes that, I guess you could make the argument that it was uh, Windows 11's fault. Mm-hmm. We, will find, we will find out soon enough. I just told it sooner rather than later because it's a kind of breaks a workflow for me. I have a button mapped to screenshots and now I can't use it yeah no i get it um i just again i i can't recommend Greenshot enough it's free and you can do the same thing what's it called Greenshot. Hmm. if you look up green shot screenshot or something like that you'll get right to it and it's uh that's what i use you can choose to use the mouse porn or not you can configure all the keyboard shortcuts for full screen active window area blah 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 all the stuff you would expect yeah automatic save to whatever location you want you know all that it's good yeah that's basically what sherrick says so if it does break maybe i'll switch maybe i yeah. won't just like Paul, switch webcams. Against my will. <laughs>